All right, guys, so I am currently on my way right now to go ahead and get my head tattooed. As you guys can see, I went ahead and shaved all my hair off and uh, I have now accepted and adopted that bald look. And I gotta say, I'm actually okay with it. I don't mind it. I was uh, I was hanging on to that hair look for the longest time and man, it was just really getting to me at the point where I just saw a huge crown at the back of my head. I saw the receding hairline, the thinning hair, and uh, I just said fuck it one, one day about a week ago and I just shaved it all off. and. Uh, now I'm starting the whole process and journey of going ahead and getting my head kind of restructured and done in terms of doing SMP. Now, tattooing my head, I do plan to eventually put a huge design on it eventually, but for now, I just want to kind of resemble and mimic a natural kind of shaved head. And that is exactly what you are going to get when you do SMP. It stands for Sakao Micropigmentation, and it pretty much just resembles small hair follicles with little dots in the skin. And that gives the illusion of like kind of the hair look when you shave it down. Now, this is going to give a much more dense look to my head. It's going to give it more of a kind of natural lineup as well. And um, I am really looking forward to how this looks because I don't mind right now the bald look on me but i would like to see it a little bit more kind of lined up a little bit more full on top and uh that is exactly what you are going to get when you do smp so i am heading to my buddy shop right now his name's james i've actually known him for a while i actually did his course on smp so that is how i really got into it i learned it a, bit, a little bit more and i was really able to see up close and for myself his work along with how he goes about things so i really trust james in terms of doing my head and uh you know making me look a lot better than uh, what I currently look right now. Because I will say right now, my head, my hair, that was one of the biggest insecurities that I've had for the longest time, ever since I was a teenager and started thinning out and having it recede a bit. It's just, it's always been at the back of my mind or <laughs> at the top of my head, or at least what was left there. And uh, now it's gonna be kind of uh, putting that whole past behind me and uh, making a big step forward in terms of a whole new look. Cause this will change how I look. It might be a little bit more fuller. It might look like I have more, much more of a hairline again. So um, I'm excited, I'm, I'm very excited. So we're gonna go right now to the shop. We're gonna get everything kind of lined up, settled in terms of uh, where everything is gonna be laid out. And then uh, we're gonna have to do about three sessions or so just because the first session is to go ahead and do the main things the second session is to go ahead and fill out it a little bit more make it a little bit more dense and then the final session is just to go ahead and uh, kind of do any little spots that uh, he may think needs to be touched up but uh, it's definitely a process it's definitely a journey but uh, it's one that I'm super excited for and uh, I hope you guys are here for the journey of it all and uh, you know hopefully this inspires maybe some people to do it as well All right, well, I'm ready, let's... All right, buddy. All right. Oh. What's your girlfriend think about this? She doesn't mind it, actually. She's supportive? Yeah, she's supportive. I was just in the washroom, and I was like, after I got out of the shower, washed my hair, I was like, fuck this. I just went and zoop. What's good about you, your, your follicles are strong. That's good. Yeah. Those are always turned the best. Like, mine are weak. When I shave down, you don't see much. So I okay. have a very soft look. Like, you know thanks, mom. Right now, you. Yeah, you did it. But it still has that natural curve when you look down. Yeah, no, I like this. No, I think you, you were playing conservative on it. It's not too high, it's not too low. Yeah. It fits the face, yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna dust that front. All right. Not bad. All right, so that's where it's for starting out. As you can see, it's uh, quite a bit lower, but it looks natural and uh, <laughs> fucking do it. Everybody ready? Yeah, let's get it done. Let's do it. As you guys can see, it literally looks like hairball.
All right, so the first session of SMP is in the books, and uh, so far, it's looking pretty good. Now, I know you're looking at it and saying, Justin, I really don't see much, and uh, that is just what, with, what the first session you're gonna kinda get. You don't wanna go too much right away because you wanna really build things up. You want it to heal, and then you go from there, and you keep building up until you got a pretty much new kind of hairline. Now, we still got two sessions left. The next session is gonna be in about two weeks. Uh, that's what I have booked at least, and then uh, from that, another two weeks we're going to kind of fill it out and then really add that density in but for the first session right now we were able to add like a more of a hairline into it and uh we lowered it a little bit more and uh, i'm very happy with that just because again one of my biggest insecurities was having a big ass forehead so bringing it down just a little bit while still keeping it look as natural as possible is something that i'm very excited for now i know a lot of people are probably asking and thinking what is the pain like and for the most part it is doable. There are some areas that suck, especially around the crown and like the sides of the head. But uh, for the most part, it wasn't anything where I was going to be tapping out. It was like a five for the most part, but uh, it's still it's still stung. And if we kind of prolong this over, you know, multiple hours, like maybe five, six, then yeah, it would definitely feel it a lot more. But this stuff with SMP, it usually takes a couple hours, and uh, that is it. So that is one of the big pros to SMP that I liked. Anyway, see you for session number two. Yeah, look at that, look at that. All right, so guys, it's been a couple of days since I had my first treatment of SMP and uh, I'm gonna zoom in for you. So as you can see, that right there is the tattoo. So it looks like hair follicles and so far so good. It looks like it's holding, we gotta go a couple more days. It's gonna heal like a regular tattoo, but uh, you know what? I'm excited to see where it comes eventually. I'm gonna have all that where it looks like it'll be a hairline and obviously it's gonna be a lot much more full. Now, again, we went conservative for the first treatment. You can always go down more, you can never go up. So if anything, if I ever look like at it, I see, you know what, maybe I wanna go down a bit more of my hairline, I can always do that. But as of right now, again, if you're looking at it, I mean, it looks like hair follicles and it looks pretty good. I'm getting excited. Still got a long way to go, but it's, it's looking good.